Yo, what is going on guys and welcome to episode 3 of my operator's guide and today I wanted to talk about using cover um, objects and walls and stuff like that to try and limit your exposure um, as much as possible when you're having a gunfight and then the other thing that goes hand in hand with that is um, the ready state you know I'm gonna try to explain what that is and uh, try to, to maintain that as much as possible but um, yeah, we're already on episode 3. Uh, if you guys have found any of the tips or any of these videos helpful, um, then definitely leave a comment or leave a like because I would um, I'd definitely appreciate it. But um, yeah, as good or bad as the maps may be, um, you know, they've put a lot of detail into them. Um, whether it's a vehicle, a barrel, uh, a desk, a sandbag, you know, a box. There's so many things that you can use as um, cover. To try and you know limit your exposure and by exposure i just mean how much of your body you're actually showing um and it's really that simple um you know it's a difference between you showing maybe your arm and your head or just your head over a box you know versus your whole body which is going to be the difference in in you winning a gunfight most of the time um and you know i'm not perfect you know i'm guilty of it too i can't tell you how many times i you know peaked my whole entire body up the side of a corner instead of just you know my arm and my head and it's gotten me killed but the goal of these of these videos are to try and practice these things and to make it a habit so that once you're actually in these gunfights um you know you don't have to actually think about it and then you can become more fluid while you're moving throughout the maps and uh and and getting those kills um these the tips also you know they may seem simple but and you know they're not super super specific to you know modern warfare they're more so general first person shooter tips but i think with the removal of um you know jet packs and wall running and all the crazy movement systems you had um it's brought the game much much closer to a traditional first person shooter where a lot of these more um general tips you know reapply to the game um but talking about ready state which is the thing that i said goes uh hand in hand with this um which really and once again i'm, I'm it's what i'm calling it. i don't know if there's an actual term or if, you know um something else that people call it but i'm just calling it the ready state for for terms of this video um and it's really just trying to be in a in a state where you can aim down sight as fast as possible um and by that i mean you know not not sprinting um not changing weapons or throwing grenades and stuff like that um you know it comes with practice but if you you know even if you like i said the the cover thing is not a it's not a um you know a guarantee that every single time you get into a gunfight you're going to be able to have a cover nearby to um to you know get behind but this is where the the ready state comes in um it's for every other every other moment um you want to be in that state to where you can be able to aim down sight as fast as possible um one of the things I, I like to do as well is to try and keep my crosshairs uh generally in the middle middle of my screen or you know where i believe the enemy is going to be um because that is going to save you you know a couple of fractions of a second you know which may seem small but you know gunfights last a second to two seconds at most um so having that little bit of time to, you know, be able to start firing on your target before your enemy does is going to, um, like I said, give you more of a chance to uh, to win to win that gunfight. Um, and I hope you guys can notice that, you know, although I'm using different clips to try and, you know, illustrate and show you what I'm talking about in these videos, um, each and every clip you can kind of trace go back and trace each of my my videos that i've put out and you know pinpoint to a moment where, where i'm doing that thing so for example in the the first video i talked about loadouts um you can see where i'm using a, a gun that's specific for the map um you can see that i'm checking my corners and clearing my sectors and then i'm once i'm actually engaging in that gunfight um i'm then using my cover to try and limit my exposure and stuff like that um so all of these things are, you know, although I, sp I split them up, um, I split them up so that, you know, they're easier to, to digest and you can, you know, try and practice one by one. But all of these videos are kind of 
what all go into you know you playing the game um from the moment that you you know you spawn in and you walk and then you get that kill all of these things are kind of taking taking into account the taking place um but uh yeah i hope you guys can um you know um hopefully gain some more from this video as well um i do plan on having out another video as well next week like i like i mentioned but um as always thank you guys so much for watching and uh have a great day we need ice, send that recon. UAV right entering the AO.